I mentioned on a recent video that there's a crawling comp coming up soon. It's in late March next year. And I've entered. I'm going to travel up to New South Wales. It's on the coast in a place called Boat Harbour, New South Wales. And I'm entering all but one of their classes. I'm going to enter the scale one, which is the beautiful scale models. There's the performance scale, which is like your C2, uh, 1.9 mini, 2.2 sporty, and 2.2 pro MOA. Plus there's a special tough trucks, something like a Capra with a tube body uh, with a maximum 5.4 inch tire. We're going to get to all that and more. Welcome to my Road to Nationals series. I'm going to weave this series in throughout the next few months as I prepare for the comp in late March next year. And I thought I'd start today with this. This is my Pro or MOA, that's Motor on Axle Crawler. Now I bought this from America uh, quite some time ago and this thing is a national champion. Someone else I know in this scene, Dion Voigt, he turned up one day and drove this thing to first place. That was in 2018. Uh, you're allowed to share the rig with one other person, so I let him drive mine on the day. You'll see I've got a thumb lever here. And it's set up for MOA. So check this out. Uh, here's the front, here's the back. So right now it's on neutral. Front and rear move at the same time. But I can just do front or just do back. And you can slide and change what proportion of throttle you give. So I have a pretty serious overdrive, for example, all the way back to rear drive. Works in reverse as well, of course. Runs on 12 volts. So I've got a little 450 milliamp hour 3S battery that lives there. Servos powered directly from it. Now this is old gear now, but it's still good. So I'm using my Samwa controller to give me that linear, uh, linear control. And I've got some team brewed brushed motors and this thing is beautifully smooth. You've got the little, uh, little ESC stack underneath as well. And all of it sits on a very lightweight body. So I'll show you how this works. So we're biased towards the front, or to the rear actually, it's been a while, there we go. So right now we're running a fairly strong overdrive, but I can equalize it just with my thumb here. And then when we get to a spot like this, if I wanted to turn this corner without touching this rock, we can just give it a much heavier front bias the rear can keep moving, and look at the angle you get on that. Now I've come in too late, so we've touched the rock, and I'll give it a little bit of rear. It basically gives you the control to navigate this thing in interesting ways. And being on 12 volts, there's a heap of power available to you. You can even, where it's appropriate, if you want to move the rear around a bit, to reposition, you can do that. It's quite nifty. So what I'll be doing in the, current, in the coming weeks to months, because we've got Christmas just around the corner too, is we're going to take this and my 2.2 Sporty, which I'll introduce next video, we'll take these out to the gorge, I'll mark out a course with gates and show you what a proper comp course is like. Uh, for the 2.2s. Now we also have the 1.9 Mini and you can see a video of my Mini on this channel already. I'll link that up, up above now. Uh, you've also met my uh, Class 2 which is our performance scale comp truck. Although I've modified that fairly considerably from when you last saw it. I'm also working out a new Class 1 comp truck. I've introduced my previous Class 1 which is a TRX4 with a Land Cruiser hard body but I've just been building well, I'll tell you what, I'll show you next time. When we do the, uh, the test courses, I'll also take you through the rules and I'll give you a bit more of the history as we go. So I'm looking forward to sharing with you my Road to National series. This is just a little start, little primer to let you know what's coming. So I'll look forward to a few more videos soon. We're gonna get this to the gorge with the sporty and I'll take you through a comp. <laughs> uh, and I've got to polish some rust off because I'm kind of rusty too. Thanks for watching. Throw me a like and I'll look forward to catching you again on RCTNT with our Road to Nationals. Thanks guys.